Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. Last time um, we are in Bergen and Burks. Hedwig came when we called her and she dropped this ladder for us. So we gotta go up the ladder to eventually, hopefully, get out of the store. Um, not stuff I can hit. Or I want beans. I want beans and wizard cards. That's all I want. Can't see anything. Oh! Ah! No, no, no! Oh, good lord! Oh, good lord! Okay. <laughs> okay. That looked like a very dangerous floor. <laughs> Let's try that again. Oh, man. Okay, let's not do that again, Harry. Let's not do that. Lemos does not last very long. Oh no! It's alright, it doesn't hurt too much. Is it Borgen or Burks that greets Mr. Malfoy? I don't remember. I think, he said, I think it was Bergen? I don't know. He needs to repair. His building, that's all. Or his landlord needs to repair his building. Oh, for the. F oh. okay. <laughs> Up the ladder, Harry. We'll, we'll get across this floor eventually. <laughs> no one seems to be hearing the uh, flooring break. Oh, good, good, good job. Get back up there. You caught it, all is well. Okay, so I can't go that way. So this way? Eh, god, Lumos is useless. Okay. Alright, okay, so crawl space. There is a... There's a wizard card here somewhere. In that chest? How do I get over there without dying? Harry, do you jump? No. No, I don't want to do that. I want to very carefully crawl against this wall. Yes, and get this chest. I'm actually kind of sad they don't show different faces for the wizard cards. It's a little sad. Okay, into the crawl space area. Let's get the hell out of here. I'm done with this place. I'm done. Now where are we? Door? There's multiple doors? Locked. What about this one? That one's to open. Okay, anything here that I want to... Nope. No flippendoing. Oh! Finally out of there! Thank goodness. Now... What? There's a chest in there. There's a chest in there and I want it. What is this? What is that? Don't know. There's another one up there. Um, Harry. Oh, okay. There really should be a game prompt. Just saying. What is this? Nocturne Alley. Oh, hold on, wait. Grab this box. Let go. Push the switch. Oh. Okay, so this door, this door has bars oh. over it, so we can't get out yet anyway. And in here. Okay, Harry, open this up. Ah, let's get out of here. There we go. Seriously, I would have just stood in front of that aisle for forever. 
really needed a game prompt for people. Okay. So, looks like we finally made it into Diagon Alley. Regenerberg's is locked. Okay, so no, we're in Nocturne Alley, sorry. More victims. Tiny Serpent. Not that we want to actually, you know, shop at any of these places. Ooh! Can't hit the jars? Okay. Wizarding supplies. That sounds fairly normal. Candy trolley. I imagine we have to find Moran in them before we um, can actually go in anywhere. But these, these I can hit. Nothing? Nintendo! Oh, could have sworn. Interesting. Maybe later? Nintendo! Huh, okay. I could have sworn those break open. Maybe later then. Hurry! Jenny! Hurry. We hoped you'd only gone one fire place too far. I was frantic with worry. What's wrong, Ginny? You don't look very happy. The flu powder went wrong, and I dropped all my things in the fireplaces I passed. Would you like me to go and look for them? That's so kind of you, Harry. But I think you'll need to get your things first. What was on your school list? A copy of the standard book of spells, grade two, from Flourish and Blots, and a new potion bar from Mole Peppers. Well, let's all go to Flourish and Blots then. Oh, and you might need this. It fell into the hearth when you used the flu powder. A silver sickle! Yeah, that's important. We need money to buy Come things, Harry. Weasley. Come on, Harry. Let's go to Flourish and Blots. I think I remember what these things are. Eh. Wait. Wait. Where am I going? I'm not going the right way. Back here. <laughs> Can I open you now? Depend on. No! Ugh! Okay, fine. I swear there's money in there! <laughs> Can I just go into Gringotts and get all my money? Because I have- I actually have gold pieces, you know. Look! Look at them all! There's so many! That I can't do anything with right now. Ooh, can I hit you? There we go. Something works. Yeah. It's probably a pet. Is this a pet shop? Can I get in here? Oh, I can! I don't know if I'm supposed to be in here. Oh, I can't break these things. Dependo. We're closed. I'm feeding the stock. Keep out. Okay. I imagine I have to have some kind of spell, although technically I could just jump over his counter. But the game's not gonna let me do that. <laughs> okay, flourish and blots, that's where we're supposed to be going. What are you? Floraline Fortescue. Oh, Floraline Fortescue. Man. <laughs> now I'm like really sad. Ah, uh, okay. It's fine. We're gonna keep going. <laughs> oh, wizarding equipment. Ooh, coin that I can't get. I can talk to you? I knew your father, you know. A fine wizard and a genuine loss. Oh. This is the sweet shop? Yeah, hey, Campbell and Jake's. We'll go in there. I, I can talk to people? Which Quidditch team do you follow, Mr. Potter? Mine's the Wigtown Wanderers. Finest team in the league. Chudley Cannons for Harry. 
Did you know that Guild War Lockhart's favorite color is lilac, and that his secret ambition is to rid the world of evil and market his own range of hair care products? Great. Great. I'm just, I'm just curious. I'm just like, what is, what is here? The Leaky Cauldron. Okay, more things for me to spell. I didn't, I don't think I've ever talked to anybody before. All right, let's get, well. If you get your second year spell book, you'll be able to cast much more powerful spells. Is Harry breathing hard because I've had him running around like crazy? We'll wait here for you while you go in. Okay. Ooh, I get to search all of the bookshelves. Yay! Ooh, okay, I picked up something that was not beans. This is so... This is so worth it. It is so time-consuming. A Bertie Bot B! They're everywhere! Everywhere! Nope, nothing there. And nothing there. Another bean. So one of the best ways, I think, if we leave the store and come back, it resets the, the beans in the store. And so you can go around and hit all the bookshelves all over again. And get lots of beans. Oh! Oh, I have a limit. Did you see that? I have a limit. I can only carry 50 at a time. Okay, so I need one more. One more, come on. No? Just one? <coughs> Give me a bean. I want a bean. I need one more, and the bookshelves are like, no. No, no, you're good. You're good, kid. You're good. What is up with this? <laughs> huh, maybe it won't because it knows I'm at the limit? Ah, there we go! Another every flavor bean! That one's just gonna stay on the ground? Okay. Alright. Is there anything in here? No. No, no, no. I want spell book, please. I'd like to buy that, please. The standard book of spells, grade two, by Miranda Goshawk. Ah, now that would be one sickle. Okay. Thank you. With the knowledge contained in this book, you'll be able to cast more powerful spells. Here's a helpful hint from the book, just for you. Build up the power on your wand and cast it when the spell is ready. But be careful. Don't overpower your spells, or you could end up in a spot of trouble. Thanks very much. Standard book of spells. Okay, so just hold it. Alright. I'm not gonna read it. We're good. We get the concept. Can I talk to you? Have you read the book I sold mm, you yet? No. No. To cast no. really powerful spells, no. you need to build up the power on your wand. I'm good, bye, thanks. And cast it when the spell is ready. Well, Harry, did you get your book? I did. Yes, Mrs. Weasley. I can't wait to try out what I've learned. Where did you lose your things, Ginny? I think I dropped my brass scales when I passed the fireplace in the magical menagerie. My new quill definitely fell into the back of Gamble and Japes. And I'm sure I saw Hagrid when I lost my speller tape, so I think that must be in the Leaky Cauldron. Hmm. Magical Menagerie, Gamble and Japes, and the Leaky Cauldron. Got it. We really appreciate this, Harry. It is so kind of you to do this for Ginny. Yes, Harry. Thanks so much. Now go on, show us what you can do with your new spells. Bet you can smash those barrels over there. Bet I can too. Yeah. Oh, nope. Dependo. There we go. Nintendo. 
Oh well, that's enough. No? There we go. There was some over here. Before I go... There was one? One over here? Yes. A silver sickle. I don't know if one sickle is realistic for a book. I don't know. I would have to go look at the uh, student equipment list to remember. I'm gonna smash these in case there's coins in them. There probably isn't. There we go. Can I talk to you? Can I talk to you? Okay. A fine wizard. And a genuine loss. I don't know if, uh, I don't know how many different dialogue. I don't need beans. I'm totally full on beans. There's no point. Um. Sickles. And I got one more. One more over here. Pass the candy cart. <laughs> Nothing. Really? There we go. Nothing in those barrels whatsoever. Good to know. Can I go into Gringotts? No. Makes me sad. I want to go into Gringotts. Okay. Can you? Which Quidditch team do you follow, oh, okay. Mr. Potter? Looks like just those three. This is. I have no idea what store I'm walking into. Where am I? What store did I just walk into? Ah, oh, that's okay. This is the apothecary. That's where this is. Can I search? I don't need to search. I have all the beans in the world. Doorway is locked. Hi. Excuse me. How much is this potion vial? It costs eight sickles. What is it? What is it that I am buying? Brilliant. Eight sickles for a glass vial with nothing in it? Drink the potion, equip it in your inventory. If he is low health, you will automatically drink the potion even if not Thank equipped. You. You're very welcome to fill your potion file with Wigan World Stamina Potion. The Wigan World's in the large cauldron over there. Thanks very much. I guess I am paying to uh, fill up the... I am paying for the potion. I just gotta fill it up myself. Alright. Was that worth it? I don't know. Who was that? Okay. Alright, let's get out of here. Okay, this is the menagerie? Yes, let's go in here. Ginny said her brass scales were in here somewhere. And he doesn't notice me, you know, breaking all of his things. There's a giant snail in there. Gonna like me being in here. What am I looking for? Her scales, Harry said. Hi. Didn't you hear me, boy? I said it. We're closed now. Go away. I don't know. Kids today. Just looking for some scales. If I'm careful, I should be able to creep past him. Well, Keep a low profile, you can sneak from pressing Harry up against walls, peek around corners, press L2 or R2, cast a spell while peeking. Okay. Must we stop on here? 
So we're oh um <gasps> okay. Sneak, I need to know where's the switch? Switch is over there. Come on you. Go down the hallway. Thank you. Go down the hallway some more. Can't see. Can't see. Where is he? Ah! Go press the switch, Harry. Press the switch. Go, go, go. Oh, frick. Open up. Open up. Open up. Open up. <laughs> ah, okay. Um. Chest. Yeah. And what is this? Oh, her scales! Yay! Ginny's brass scales. All right. Now, how do I get back out? Just go back out the door. Pretend I wasn't here ever. I wonder if the noise of a spell might distract him. Okay, where the hell is he? Hopefully he goes towards the spell and not where he heard my voice. Whoever's out there, I'll find you. Open the door, Harry. Open the door. Never here, bye. Okay, we've gotten Ginny's scales. We need to go to the Leaky Cauldron and the joke shop. Um, I think this is a good place to end this episode. So, what is this? I swear something moved. Um, uh, yeah, so we will continue next time. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe. Social media links in the description. I'll see you later. Thanks for watching.